this is the outline of a centrifugal governor uh, let us come to know how does it work so this is a bevel gear this gear mounted on the engine shaft this is the engine shaft and this is bevel gear this is the spindle of the governor so this shaft is connected to the engine let us the engine speed is 100 rpm now load increases if load will increase then the shaft speed will decrease this is connected to this gear that means this spindle will move lesser speed that means this ball will fall down as the ball will fall down centrifugal force will be less it will fall down then it is connected to this sleeve the sleeve will fall down if this sleeve will fall down according to the movement of this bell crank lever the fuel supply will increase if the fuel supply will increase then the speed of the engine will increase at a very few seconds the equilibrium reached that means it will maintain same speed 100 rpm at more load condition